Hey everybody, what's up? This is part two of why I'm boycotting PS4. Boycott PS4. Let me tell you guys. Because, like I said previously, no backwards compatibility. If you've ever had a system, you know exactly what that means. That means you, all your games that you have suffered, worked for, you know, thousands of hours to get these games, they're going bye-bye. They're not going to mean nothing. I mean, some of you guys, maybe you already played them through, you're done with them, whatever. You're just used to doing that. And you're like, well, I want, I, I get change over on my game so much anyway, it doesn't really matter, right? But think about it, folks. It does matter. It really does matter, right? It matters because if you do decide to play them later, I mean, maybe not Mirror's Edge. It's a one, Mirror's Edge is a, I mean, sorry, not Mirror's Edge. It's a one-player game. But, I mean, just for the nostalgia, you might want to play some of your games, like your Tekkens or your whatever. You're not going to be able to play those games. Sure, they're going to give you some new games. They're going to say, oh, yeah, this is the brand new Tekken and everything. But the thing is, again, you'll have to, have to play, pay to play online. And see, they're not going to bend on this. They're not going to bend on this unless we just don't buy it. That's the only way you can stop this. Because once it gets going, folks, once they get it going, then it's over. It's just like the fat cats behind, you know, raising your gas or whatever. It's, I'm just tired of all this bull crap. I mean, it's some selfish people with power that's behind all this stuff. They don't care about the rest of us. They don't care what happens to us. They don't care how much money we spend every day. And, I mean, now we got to get down to the point where our little enjoyment, our little games, you know what I'm saying? Nobody should be able to tell you what to do with your enjoyment. You know what I'm saying? So people, whatever background you are, culture, whatever, it's time for us to stand together, for real. If you like what I'm saying, put, give me a thumbs up. And at least give me a thumbs up and agree with me. Type down there, just type down there, I'm boycotting PS4. You know what I'm saying? And maybe I'll get a website started eventually, a Facebook. We can blow that up, too. But really, it's going to have to be that you put the action in your mouth is, you know what I'm saying? I'm serious. I know you guys, you're like, well, you're telling me what to do with my enjoyment. Maybe I want to buy it. You're not going to make me not buy it. But what I'm trying to do is save you and us all something much later, you know. So I see how these people are selfish. They man they're manipulating us, man. That's all I'm saying. But if we don't stand together, which this is what usually happens when, when fat cats get the money, basically, they know how to separate you, divide you. Use brainwashing tactics, tactics, because that's exactly what commercials are. You know what I'm saying? Eat this. It'll make you feel stronger. You know, get this TV. If you don't get it, you're going to be really, really sad. Your life's going to be over. That's basically what it is, brainwashing, folks. And that's what they're doing with the PS4. They're brainwashing it. Just because it's the name, PlayStation, oh, oh, wow. They got us to the point where we're just like that. So that's what I'm saying. Look at the actual features. Actually, look at what you're buying, folks. Don't just buy it. Look at what you're buying. Like, what's up with that? That's some bull crap, man. You got to pay. I mean, I understand when you have a choice. Like, this is free. We had free online play. And then you had the PS Plus, right? And the PS Plus was separate where you could buy it if you wanted to. If you wanted to rent all these games, rent them and test, test them out. That's like uh, how that net game or whatever the other game, Gamefly used to be, okay? That's basically where they got the idea from, from being Gamefly. So they did the same thing with Gamefly where you could rent these games, you get some free games for a while, and then after your months was up, then you, they took it back. But what I didn't like about that was even the little Sega games and the things they said were, were free, free, well not really free. They shouldn't even put free, they should just say rent, right? Rental, that would be honest, but they say free. So they were lying to us from the get-go, because when I first got PS Plus, I thought, this is free, this is free, this is free. I thought they were giving away like certain games, right? And the rest of them were not free. It was rent. But they were lying. It wasn't free. At the end of that month, that stuff was gone. Man, they yanked that stuff right out of my system. I couldn't even play my little Sega games no more. I was like so disappointed. And they don't even care, man. That shows you they don't care about the customers. As much as they say they care about you, all they care about is one thing, that green dollar, y'all. But we got the power over that green dollar because it belongs to us, right? So if we got the green dollar and they need it, then they ain't got no power over us. We got to do something, man. Don't spend no $500, $400. You can use that to eat, man. Why are we on EBT right now, right? <laughs> Listen, 
y'all, go spend that four hundred dollars. Wait on it. Make them wait on it. And then we need to make a statement somewhere. I need to get enough people on here to say, yes, I'm boycotting. And then when I see it's enough people, we're going to do something. We're going to make a statement to PS4, Sony, and so forth. So y'all give me some thumbs up. Give me thumbs up. Blow this up. Say, you know what? We're with you. We're boycotting PS4. Yeah, okay. I don't have a lot of special effects on this here episode. For real. For real talk. We need to boycott it together. Okay, that's all I'm asking you to do. Help me out. Help me out. You know what I'm saying? All right, y'all. Peace. is God Horde signing off. If you haven't said it, everybody said blessings to Jesus is Lord. Have a good day. And uh, Mazel Tov, everybody. You know what I'm saying? And much love to you. Much love to you. Everybody have a good day. and Have a good day. All right. Somebody said, say Jesus is Lord. God bless you. That's my blessing to you.